All righty. I have a construction update for you guys today. Um, there's been a lot of questions over the last couple weeks. Why has construction slowed down? Why aren't they working in extreme sky flyers plot of land? Are you sure it's going to go over there? And I've been constantly telling everyone in the park that's been coming up to me and people even in my own Discord call that have been coming in and asking that I am extremely confident that this ride is going over to Extreme Skyflyer. Don't worry. Just wait and see. And I have a really good video for you actually inspired by Jake um, that'll be coming out tomorrow uh, to help calm some of your nerves as well. But this video is going to put to rest a lot of those concerns. But over at uh, Tunnel 3 on the construction site, they've closed off view into the mountain. So they're definitely about to start work in there and they don't want us to see anything. Um, in true Wonderland fashion, they have kept this project a complete secret from everyone. And it is honestly, to be honest, really fun. Um, but yes, they don't want anyone knowing anything. They don't want anyone seeing anything. We are five and a half days away from announcement. So yeah, I'm excited. Hopefully you guys are excited. Um, as you can see, they've started to remove a little bit more of the construction fencing over in Elpin Festival. So I guess we have an official name for the area. Um, outside of that, no further work going on in the station area. They've cleaned up the land a little bit. My assumption is another construction team will come in and start digging ground on the station. Um, outside of that, nothing too exciting is going to be happening here before announcement. Um, I am low-key wondering if they are going to have any sort of piece of the coaster available for the announcement. Um, from what I've heard, uh, they have just actually started manufacturing the coaster track and supports as of late, like literally within the last week and a half. So that's crazy. Um, but yeah, I really like the adventure and storyline that Wonderland is teasing with this coaster. And it brings up a really core fact about the direction that Canada's Wonderland's heading. And that is theming. So if you even look here, Wonderland's been working on these snack buildings and they've been eliminating kind of those not so well themed things around the park. Um, and it's just been great to see Wonderland step forward into a theme park atmosphere. So really excited to see what's going to happen with this coaster. Um, I've already heard um, from my Discord in general chat, the one day I decided to sleep in and record this video and then go to Wonderland, uh, that there is new teasers up in the park on a brand new construction banner. So you'll see that in tomorrow's update or on my Instagram story. Um, Hartwell, the electrical company, has started electrical work in the area of this major element. Um, so, yes, uh, you're going to see a lot of work starting here soon because on the screen, very shortly, you're going to see that they've started marking the coaster um, in this area. So really excited to see that transpire um, in the construction updates and in some thoughts uh, before the announcement. Um, but, yeah. How excited are you guys? Do you think we're working? We're looking at a world record breaker or a Canada record breaker? Um, so as you can see here, some footings for the coaster in Extreme Sky Flyers Plot of Land have been marked. Um, they're the little nails with the orange ribbons on them. Uh, there is four currently in this area. Um, they are heading out back towards the back of Flight Deck um, or the service road in a straight line. So that is interesting. Because my prediction is that it was going to stop at Extreme Sky Flyer and then head back. So it's really, it's it's weird to see it start heading back towards Extreme Sky Flyer with no evidence of um, kind of like an up and back. Um, but we'll have to see. They had only marked four. So we'll wait and see for, for further markings um, to get a better idea. Right now, the last marking we have is at the very back of Extreme Sky Flyer by the Storm Sewer. Um, so, uh, yeah, we'll be keeping a close eye there um, and seeing where this transpires because this is a really exciting project. And honestly, the fact that we're going to know in five and a half days is crazy. Anyways, thank you so much for watching these construction updates and supporting the channel. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited to uh, keep covering the construction. And I have a really special project that I'll be able to announce soon, very soon. Um, that we're working on as well. So thank you so much um, for your support and watching these construction updates. Have a good one, guys. Bye.